Wade State Shapiro with everything you need to know about your weekend at Georgia LSU. Let's assume you're going to New Orleans like I am this weekend, looking forward to great football on Saturday. Here are some tidbits about being in New Orleans and some tidbits for your trip to Baton Rouge. First of all, let's talk about the football game. This is a game that Mark Rick wins. Why? Because I've seen him do it before. One of the great road SEC coaches in the history of the SEC. They go on the road and they get it done. Why? Because they're starting to get into their groove and really talking about Sean Marino. The Sean Marino you're going to see this Saturday is going to remind you of the one you saw against the Gators last year in Jacksonville. He uh, carved up Vanderbilt. He ran hard against Tennessee, and he is going to be the difference on Saturday. Stafford will make enough plays to Massaquan. You want Trip Chandler to be in the game. We don't know if he's going to play, and obviously A.J. Green. The quarterback position, Hatch and Lee versus Matthew Stafford, huge advantage for Georgia. In a game like this, how does those playmakers not make a difference? LSU, until last week, 10th rated SEC defense. They're not playing at the level you think they should. They'll play much better than they did against the Gators. This is a 20 to 14, 20 to 16 win for Georgia. They make enough big plays and they win on the road and look for Georgia to do what they have to do. As for New Orleans, it's about a 45 minute to an hour drive. So depending how early you leave New Orleans, leave some time. It's close to game time. It's going to take about an hour and a half. You leave earlier the night before, it's about a 45-minute ride to Baton Rouge. As for New Orleans, a couple of quick little tidbits. Best bar, burger, spot in New Orleans, port call The other end of the French Quarter, this is the spot you get monsoons at. You've heard about it. A monsoon and a cheeseburger and old-school New Orleans with a great jukebox. Great spot. Go have breakfast or lunch at Mother's for the best pole boys around. Also, uh, big night out, Dickie Brennan Steakhouse in the French Quarter, a guy's night out for big steaks, kind of like Bones and Chops and those kind of places. And uh, just take it all in. There's a, there's a bunch of great spots uh, all over uh, New Orleans to be weekend. Mr. B's Bistro, if you want a great Italian spot, New Orleans style Italian, Irene's. These are some spots to think about. And enjoy also, uh, if you like the Warehouse District, do that. And the Voodoo Festival going on in New Orleans this weekend as well. Some of the great bands. Uh, go online, voodoofestival.com or New Orleans Google Voodoo Festival. It's a huge weekend in New Orleans. It's a huge weekend for Georgia football. Enjoy it. Georgia gets it done. Georgia, Florida, two weeks away. The big matchup, Tebow and Stafford. Mm, I'm licking my chops. I can't wait. <laughs>